Hello guys, in this video tutorial we will tell you how the taxi feature works on the mobile device and show you how the passenger app and driver app works in it. Let's start booking a ride through the passenger app. Open the app on your device and tap the taxi service feature. If you already have an account, then sign in else signed up. Once you have signed in, a map will open showing your current location. From here, you can change your pickup location if you want. Next, in the drop off location field, enter your destination. As soon as you provide the drop off location, you will see vehicle options along with their pricing. You can also check the distance and the estimated time to cover the distance. Select your preferred vehicle type and then tap payment method. Now select your desired payment method from the options. If you have a coupon code, tap promo code and enter the code. Once done, tap book now to start requesting the drivers. You also have the option to book a ride later. Once you have booked the ride, all the available drivers will, will receive the booking request which they can accept and reject on the driver app. The driver app is shown on the left side and the passenger app on the right side screen. From the driver app, now let's accept the ride. Once the driver accepts the ride request, the passenger will receive their acceptance notification. Now in the passenger app, passengers can track the driver's location, call the driver, view driver details, and share the ride details from different platforms. They can also cancel the ride if they want. On the other hand, the drivers can see the passenger's pickup point, booking ID, and also call the passenger from the driver app. Once the drivers have reached the pickup point, they will need to tap the I have a ride button to notify the passengers. Now the driver can tap begin journey to start the ride. Also the passengers will receive a notification that the ride has started. Once the ride ends, the driver can tap the passenger drop button to stop the ride. If there is any toll amount, they can enter it here. Once done, tap submit and and an invoice will be generated on the driver's app. The driver can also rate the passengers and share feedback. Once done, tap submit to go back to the driver's home screen. The passenger will also receive the receipt of the ride. The passenger can rate and write a review for the driver. Once done, tap submit to go back to the passenger home screen. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they are live.